Yanni, yanni. So I am loving drinking rainwater, I've got to say. I really like these tanks. I like the size of them. I like the look of them. Don't put them in without sealing this here. Some of that sealant tape or some silicone. That's definitely one thing you need to remember. All three of them have leaking taps. While you're at it, put some something around these parts here. They're fine, they're not leaking, but um, I did at first wonder if, if they were, so I would be putting some silicon or tape around those parts as well. As far as doing the joins between them, uh, you need to cut the pipe. Otherwise, you know, I had this, I've just strung that up, but otherwise the pipe was down here and you're not getting the pressure to transport the water from one to the next. Lids come off easy, you know, they're just like a, a clip lid and it all seals very well. So not a problem with those tanks. Now I joined them to my bigger tank, to my West Coast Poly, which is a really good tank. I got it from Bunnings, uh, pretty cheap, 500 bucks. And I really like this. So I've joined, I've taken the overflow from that and I've joined that into my maze tanks over here rather than starting straight from a, from a down pipe. I really, I really like this tank, this West Coast Poly. It is, it, the tap has no leaks whatsoever. The tap is really, really good. And as far as getting the water in there, I've just made myself a little bit of extra mesh so that there's a double sort of filtration of um, any gunk that's going in there. And this lifts out, so that's all good. I've also put some extra stocking around the pipe just to stop anything that is coming out there. So as you can see, there's a lot of dust in that now and I can just wash that off. So it's getting that first bit of gunk of rainwater um, that's coming off the roof and um, yeah they're like there's a fair bit of fair bit of dust in there you know. I originally had the rain diverter, the first wash diverter. So I had a long bit of pipe coming down here and this rainwater diverter took the first lot of rain down to here but I took it off and I sawed off the pipe and I just put a cap on the end of it because I found that the rainwater diverter was just taking so much of the rainwater and it wasn't it wasn't actually filling my tank. Um, they actually have sort of a drip system on the end of them and I just found all the rainwater was dripping out. So yeah, that, that all works for me. We've just got, I've just got guttering coming off the edge of the patio there um yeah so it so it all really works well i'm gonna get a couple more maze tanks i really really like them and i just think they're so convenient to move around and um yeah all good it's i just find i'm drinking so much more water and coffee always but um, i'm drinking so much more water than i used to when i was drinking the tap water which is now that i compare it to having drunk the rain water um the tap water is disgusting and i just feel like i'm I'm actually having a drink, like a drink that I would buy at the shop. Like it feels like a proper, like it's nourishing me and filling me up. So I'm just loving rainwater so much.